Welcome to NAB Show 2024. The preeminent event for the entire media and broadcast industry. Right here in Las Vegas. Ashley within broadcast, joining me is Macaran of Waller. Hello. Hello. Hi. So tell me, what is Waller's current position right now in the media and broadcasting market? So Waller is a company that's been around in business for about 40 years. Um, we've uh, we introduced the first audio monitors in the industry and we've continued to innovate in that area, uh, paying close attention to the problems that our customers have faced uh, and trying to inno innovate on their behalf. We try to anticipate their problems and build solutions um, that solve their problems, uh, you know, before they become a major stumbling block for them. We obviously work closely with our customers to help define our products uh, and we enhance them in collaboration. And so, you know, we've been able to earn a lot of goodwill and trust with our customers over the last 40 years uh, as a well-known brand in the broadcast monitoring space. Absolutely. And what trends are you seeing as far as your technology in the media and broadcasting market? How have you adapted with that for the future? Sure. So one of the key trends, uh, you know, there's a, there's, a, there's a huge transition to IP signaling that's underway. Um, a, a lot of uh, major broadcasters are now switching infrastructure towards IP. Uh, there is some movement towards the cloud, uh, but you know, applications are sort of picked and chosen uh, because an, a, a wholesale transition to the cloud is prohibitively expensive. Uh, one of the other areas that we see that is exciting and interesting to us is a drive towards improving productivity. Uh, you know, essentially trying to do more with less. Uh, uh, you know trying to achieve, maximize outcomes from a limited workforce. Uh, and so we've, you know, we focus in that area. Uh, we see a, a significant overlap between that area and what we do, um, you know, in terms of um, improving and enhancing the value provided by monitoring. Because we see a, the, the number of signals increasing over time, uh, but manpower not necessarily scaling at the same pace. Uh, and you know, and, and broadcasters, like every other business, are under pressure to improve productivity, cut costs, and maintain uh, profitability. And so we feel uh, we have a good role to play in that space. And so what are you showcasing here currently at NAB? So at NAB this year, uh, one of our major uh, releases is, is something we call Maverick. Maverick um, is our first comprehensive uh, suite of software applications. Um, this is a set of applications that can be deployed either in the cloud as a hosted service by us, managed entirely by us, or uh, into our customers' uh, cloud or, or, or on-prem uh, on infrastructure. Uh, and Maverick comprises basically of three applications. Uh, it's, we've got remote monitoring, we've got uh, alerting, automated alerting, and the third application is built-in conferencing. Uh, remote monitoring uh, essentially allows our customers to get out of the constraints of a single rack or a single location. Our in-rack monitoring is excellent if you have a single facility that you're looking to monitor. The moment you try to get out and, and, and monitor adjacent facilities or adjacent locations or maybe some location that's uh, in another part of the world, uh, monitoring becomes prohibitively expensive. And Volor is, feels that that does not have to be the case. So our remote monitoring solution helps our customers extend the reach of their monitoring systems without incurring prohibitive costs. Uh, so that's what, what we do with remote monitoring. Alerting is a system where, uh, so, so, so what we have is the notion of probes. Uh, and probes can feed uh, remote monitoring, uh, re feed the remote monitoring application, allowing you to look at stuff remotely, and also continuously monitor your signal for error conditions which means uh, you can move towards a, a, a monitor by exception paradigm rather than having to continuously look at stuff. Uh, and so alerting is, is an application uh, which, which, will, which will alert your operators in the event of something going wrong, you know? And it could be a complex series of events that trigger an alert, uh, which, which really demand the attention. And then the third piece is built into this entire application is a, a conferencing uh, uh, element where a group of operators can quickly call each other without have to, having to sort of get out of the context, look up somebody's number, dial them, or use a different tool to, for that communication. So it helps drive sort of very rapid resolution of problems. And so you can do a group call to call a group of guys uh, or, uh, or, 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 or 
individual you know point to point calls so that that's what that suite of applications is um, and so that's our launch for the 2024 uh, at, at 2024 at, at NAB 2024 uh, can you tell me a little bit more about your latest developments and who you're targeting with your prospective use cases? Right. So we're targeting uh, all our existing customers. We feel they can benefit. Uh, and obviously new customers that, that are looking to sp solve specific problems. What we found is that there's a set of problems outside of traditional in-rack monitoring that don't have high quality economical solutions. Uh, and that stack of problems is stands unsolved. Wohler is a leading uh, monitoring company uh, across the world, with, you know, with a footprint across the world, and it's almost as if we have to step up to that expectation to solve that set of problems. And um, so the way we're, 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 we're offering this to our existing customers is by saying that, hey, your existing monitoring equipment can be integrated with our, with, with our probes that feed into Maverick. So you don't have to go out and buy new equipment. You know, we have software probes that run on our existing monitors that can connect into Maverick. We have hardware options that can be plugged into your existing monitors that can connect into Maverick. And we also launched a new open gear card. Uh, so if you have a remote location, you know, many broadcasters have production studios in downtown areas, and uh, a lot of their backends are out of the city. There's not any operators there to look at a front panel. So we've built this open gear ca car that you can plug into the chassis uh, and you know, know what's happening in the remote location sitting right here in your downtown location. It also supports, uh, you know, uh, post COVID, you know, there's a lot of remote work. Uh, you know, that genie is not going back into the bottle. People are going to continue to work remotely. And so Maverick is designed to support those workflows. So you can have an operator, uh, you know, sort of take a call, uh, get an alert and be able to deal with it from any location. He doesn't have to be physically in front of the equipment. Um, and so, so that's how we're tar you know, sort of offering this as a solution to existing customers. And then there are new customers who look at, for example, our open gear solution and say, hey, this is something that we could use uh, for an application that is not an in-rack monitoring application. So you know, we see a, a, a broadening of the base uh, of customers and also, uh, like I said, problems that have been unsolved, getting solved in an effective and cost uh, effective way. And what would you say is next for Waller? So we continue to work closely with our customers. We continue to try to anticipate their problems, collaborate with them. And we, you know, every day we, we, we get up and try to meet the expectations our customers have from us, which is they would like us to innovate on their behalf. And we see a lot of growth and revenue potential in, in continuing to do what we do well. Uh, and maintaining fidelity to our brand. Absolutely, we look forward to what's next. Uh, those that want more information, please check out their website. Thank you so much for speaking with us Indeed. today. Thank you so much, Thank it's you. been a pleasure.